The fortress known as Orange Theory Stadium have defending premiership title holders Canterbury host in the Bay of Plenty Volcanics as we enter the business end of the regular season of the Farah Palmer Cup. Ball bobbles out now. They'll get it into the hands of Taps. Well, they've got numbers here. Bay of Plenty. Happy to take it into the contact. Terini. And now it's been picked up by Rule. Rule charging forward. Hey, Barnage. Barnage. Entry. Leave it. To the right, they go quick hands. Gaper throws the dummy, then goes halfway through. She could score and she will. What a beauty. Oh, Amy Roll again. The good Southland did all from Riverton. She turns it over and takes 40 metres right up there. Okay, hold. Yep. Short line out means that they've got oh, some forwards out in the back line. Reynolds sets another target for them. Running ball, that's intercepted. Steinmetz has just read it beautifully. She's got the pace to skip away. Too much class from Grace Steinmetz. Couldn't believe her luck. And that's her third try for 2021. Canterbury. Oh. Hold there. Now look to try and inflict more pain. They'll go straight oh, through there, the middle man. if they can. Yep, Miller got isolated. Great to tackle now. Great defence from Bay of Plenty. It's cleared into the hands of Love. Tackle roll. Numbers to the left. Cox Edge gives it quickly back to Georgia Miller. She offloads to Ponsonby into the hands of Bremner. Captain goes a metre short. Take respect. Canterbury on the attack as easy as you like. Steinmetz. Says I'll have a double today, thanks. Oh, well, you know, Bay of Plenty was scrambling there. Kendra could see that the short side was open and just opens it up with a good handling there. Canterbury have dominated so much to think that Auckland have won it that many times, but a scrum here. In total control, Canterbury. Gap it to the line, gives it off to Duplessis, who runs on the outside line as she goes straight through the gap. She beat Baker on that occasion, got on her outside shoulder. It was the drift defence and the drift of the ball and the line that she ran that allowed her to go through the gap. And Amy Duplessis brings on the bonus point after 30. Ponsonby in the middle of the field. Great to see Georgia Ponsonby. That Use it! Hooker just happy to run with ball. And now they'll just work it through their forwards. Anderson. 38 carries prior to this game. They pick and go. Philip and Love race. sets it. Here goes Rule. Working in tandem are the two props. And then the front row of Ponsonby picks up to make it a trifecta. Held on to it, though. Yeah, you can see the ball. Someone had a lick at it. And then it... Boy! Sit! Living off scraps, but finding a way to be positive and Cox Edge running ball out the back to Gapper scored one will pass out and now Duplessis picks up a double as well Four pass it's gone forward though so um, from my position that I'm sitting maybe Tori could have given the ball a little bit earlier and that way give Duplessis a go hold there hold Bay of plenty yep. if it kicked it down to Duplessis she finds Gapper comes back and there's plenty of real estate as well gapper looking for support finds jenkins good tackle made on jenkins that had to be made connor now drives your opposite back coxage parks she's taken the ground six short no advantage on the side another advantage for in the side and coxage knows that they can just throw everything at it the kick pass from mcgovern it's going to be taken by Wycliffe, and they'll come back for the penalty. What's he going to do here? Is there a double blast? What do you got? Time off. Oh, he's putting 20. his hand in Goal. the pocket here, will he? Yeah. Captain, I've given you one already. We're pretty fragments. She's clearly coming on the side, okay? Hello, card. Parks in the back Hello. again for Canterbury. Scrum's been good. Parks again. Offloads to Cox Edge. They've got runners. And the intercept here from Bay of Plenty. How much petrol in the tank? They're coming from everywhere for Canterbury. But she's got enough pace 
And this is going to be fantastic for Bay of Plenty. And Mahina Paul puts it down. And they push nice and hard. And then she goes, bang, picks it up and puts those afterburners on. Everyone is chasing. Dupas Lee's pitch in Stymex, Jenkins, Brooker. But no one could catch her because she's got speed to burn. It's a beautiful, beautiful read by Mahina Paul. Kenyon Paul doesn't find touch and Steinmetz says hey, might cost you because the chase wasn't good. It was all over the place and now they get it out. Duplessis, the no-look pass out to Jenkins. She's had a mortgage on the right wing here. Bremner gets hammered by Reynolds. Back over here. It comes across and bang. Ooh. There's arms in there though, so I'm not... One goal, anyway. Please. We've got foul play here, okay? Yeah. We've come from a distance. It's late, it's a shoulder. It's a yellow card, okay? Yeah. Okay. As a former tight forward, by the time you race to catch a back, boy, yeah. don't get them very often. Leave it! Phil Hay there, Fox. Yeah. Goes in, cleans out, and now Henny again. Nice ball. Big wide pass out to Duplessis. Beats a couple of defenders, does Duplessis. Ball is there. Bay of Plenty may have had a chance to get it, but they weren't quick enough. And now the inside ball to Brooker. Brooker breaking through a couple of tackles. She's inside the 22. Support is there. Greenslade. Oh, they take a prop off and then they bring the new ones on and they do exactly what the others were. Stay nine. I think the siren may have sounded a wee bit premature, but they're going to carry on with play. Brooker no, leave it. sets it. Heaney. They go a little wider out to Parks. Come on for Anderson. Now the kick. They've said enough's enough. And Canterbury, who led 26 7 or 26 0 at the break, have finally won 26 7.